Hi, I'm René Grothmann, the author of Euler-Mass Toolbox. In this video, I want to show you how to solve differential equations in Euler. Assume we have a differential equation with an initial value like this. Then we can solve the equation numerically in the following way. First, we define a function f of x and y. Then we define the points where the equation is to be computed. And then we solve the equation with ODE. The 1 is the initial value. The XL are the points. We can plot the results. Next, we want to plot the solution left of 0. For this, we define a vector of points going from 0 to the left to minus 10, solve the equation, and plot the result by concatenating the points and the values. We add the point of our initial value. This equation can be solved numerically with maxima. Here we are using ODE2 in the following form. Note the upper stroke in front of diff. Otherwise, y would be differentiated. We get this result. We can add the initial condition x0 and y1 and we can make a function of the result. Let us plot on everything. The result is the same. As you see there are some numerical inaccuracies which are unavoidable. Let's try a second order equation. Here is a second order equation with two initial values. We have to rewrite this into a system of equations with u1 equal to y and u2 equal to y prime. The system is this system. Now our function has to, be defined, has to be defined like this. f of x u is u2, x minus u1. See the differential equation. We solve it to the right of 0. Here's a solution. We get a, a vector of solutions. The first line is our function u1 and the second line is u2. We plot the first line which is the solution. The solution can be solved numerically or symbolically with ODE2 in the same way as we did above. The initial condition now has to take into account the derivative, the function for this is ic2. So let's try to run this. Sorry, this should be u. You see the result is very good. Most of the time there is no symbolic solution. Let's take the following differential equation. Let's try with uh, Wolfram Alpha. I've put a link to Wolfram Alpha into this command, which tries to solve the solution. As you see, only numerical solutions are found.
So now we use ODE2 and get false, which means no solution found. But we can solve this easily numerically with ODE2. By the way, ODE uses a L soda algorithm. That's a very good algorithm. Here's the solution. Let's run this. You see the solution. Thank you for listening.